Hey everyone, let's have a little chat about Norma by Sofia Oksanen. And I don't know, this was kind of a weird read. Full disclosure, it was a cover by, I didn't know anything about it, I just read the first few lines and thought I'd like it. The book basically starts with the funeral of our main character, Norma's mother. And I thought that was interesting. I thought it was about grief and her handling with the deaths and how her life continues which it sort of was, but not completely. So I was surprised when all of a sudden I found myself in a magic realism mystery. So our main character, Norma, has magic hair or something like that, which is mentioned on the back of the book. There is also another mystery going on in the book, which is not mentioned on the back, so I'm not going to spoil that here. But the hair is a huge part of the story and it's all about hair industry and hair products and beauty industry. and. That is sort of interesting. The mystery aspect is a lot about Norma trying to find out why her mother committed suicide. So that shall be enough about the story. Let's talk a little bit about the writing and the mystery aspect. So the writing was nice. I liked how it was written in the beginning and the general style of the writing I enjoyed. But the mystery aspect? You know me, I don't really read mystery novels because I'm an impatient person and a slow reader. That doesn't go well with mystery because it takes me forever to get to the results. Another part is that I don't really like the style of getting snippets of information, snippets of information where I think like, why don't they look at everything at the first time and then solve the thing? But that's a mystery style of writing that I'm not a big fan of that is used in this book. It's not badly done, it's well done. But for me, it dragged on a little bit and towards the end, I was basically just confused and didn't know what the book wanted to tell me. At other points, I found it very too obvious where things were mentioned and spelled out which you could understand. And the writing could have just conveyed that information or attitude without exactly spelling it out. It's a lot to do with women's treatment in the beauty industry, which I found very obvious and I didn't need it to be spelled out and said directly by one of the characters. Overall, I thought this book has a lot of interesting aspects. And if you like mystery style of writing, you will enjoy this book a lot more than I did. I did enjoy it. I did enjoy the magical realism of it. I liked the small set of characters and our main character is very interesting. But overall, I was a little bit confused and basically bummed out with the mystery part of it. As usual, I would like to hear from you. Have you read the book? Are you interested in it? Have you heard about it? Let's talk in comments about Norma. Thank you all for watching. Bye-bye.